video what we ended up doing is plowing field 15 to make it longer. Um, pretty much the standard width all the way up to field 12. And using the hectare counter in the harvester we're going to see how much bigger we actually made field 15. So on this field we just planted soybeans. Uh, we're not going to fertilize anything like that because I don't believe yield is going to dictate how many heck acres you actually harvest. So with that in mind, um, let's so get going. Field 15 is the darkest shade of orange, uh, ready to harvest. The whole field is that way. Um, I think that's the only thing that I'm going to do before I harvest. Like I said, I'm not going to fertilize or anything like that, but we're just going to make sure that it's the darkest orange and um, harvest this field and see how many hectares we actually harvested compared to the stock size. Um, on this map here you can see I pretty much went to the road on the south side and the west side and on the north west side you can see I went up to that road as well. Um, that's just so these fields didn't blend in. I did try blending them in. It doesn't work well with hired help and course play doesn't necessarily like it either. Um, though I didn't try to record my own path um, just with the stock, let's say, uh, fine field edge and then use course play, um, it was running into some difficulty. So anyway, we're going to find out what the stock size is to our new size. So we got our harvester set up. Of course I bought like the best one that the game comes with. Not a mod. Um, I got GPS mod on just to line up and we're going to use a hired worker to harvest this field for us. This will be the first time I used a hired worker to harvest a field. I have used them to plow over what I had originally plowed in networks. I also used them to cultivate in that works as well as seeding. Um, those three items did work with hired help for our newly designed field or extended field. So we're going to try the hired help with the harvester and then I'm going to take the semi and unload them as he gets full. We're just going to start off this field for now, and then we'll switch to hard worker. You can see our hectare counter going up, lower right, uh, 0 0.05. We just want to see how much we made this field bigger. Here we go, hired help. He's extending out because the semi was close.
So stock field, we're going to go over this field with the same thing that our extended field had, which is soybeans. And then we're going to grow it and then harvest it and get those numbers. And we're going to hire a worker. So here is the stock size of 15. We had planted soybeans on it. Um, the whole field is covered, which is a good start. The hired worker did a good job with that. Like I said, I don't care if it's fertilized or it needs plowing. We're just going to harvest it to get that hectare number uh, from it. So we're going to fast forward time, get this harvest ready to go, bring a harvester down, and uh, harvest it. So you can see field 15 is ready to harvest. That's the dark orange. We are going to get in our harvester. We are going to set it up with GPS mod. And we're going to hire a worker. Looks like... Looks like we missed a little bit of that field there. The edge isn't perfect. Um, now let's see what we get. Uh, we're all lined up. We're going to go ahead and harvest it. Um, we'll see what the numbers are. We could probably try to cultivate and seed it again and see if we can get closer to that edge. But that's what the hired worker did. Uh, we're going to hire a worker to harvest it. This harvester should fill the whole field into it. This is pretty big capacity. And we got a hired worker. Now you can see we got 0.7 hectares or 0.74. Um, I'm going to go ahead and plow this field and then cultivate it, seed it, and see if we can't get closer to the edge. So pass one, 0.74. We're going to do it again, see if we get the same thing and then base those uh, two numbers on our new expanded field. Let's see what we get. All right, so we got our plow, we got our tractor. Um, we're going to plow this field with GPS mod Make sure we get the whole thing, and then proceed to seed it.
Okay, so we replowed the field, reseeded the field, um, got it to grow all the way to the dark orange, ready to harvest point. We're going to go ahead and harvest this field and see if we get the same number, 0.74, of harvestable hectares. We are going to use a hired worker, but we're going to use GPS mod to line up and get started. There is an option, I see we got 0.7 and 0.74 on our lower right for our numbers. There is an option here if you look in your controls, F1 if it's not up, um, left alt and delete will reset session hectare counter. Left alt, delete. So if you look to the lower right, the number on the left is total hectares harvested by this harvester almost like an hour meter and the right one's gonna be this session or this field or between reset points it doesn't look like there is a way to reset both of those numbers so for right now we're gonna go off of the number on the right we're going to hire a worker And away we go. So we are at 0.78 with harvesting the second time around. Our original number was 0.74, so we are 0.04 hectares more this time than previous. Um, the edging last time was sketchy, even though I did take the cedar over that, because I noticed it before it started growing. And maybe that was the difference. Um, maybe if we do it the third time, it'll be 0.76. I don't know. But I would say they're pretty close. Um, but how much more is that to our new field number? Our new field number was 1.87 when we had expanded this field out. Almost all the way to field 12. So that was 1.87. We are about 2.4 times bigger than this field. So what you're really gaining is 1.4 times the size of this field. So 1.4 of these fields in addition to it. So 1, 
another one and then 0.4 more. That's almost another half size of this field. So you could say about one and a half times or one and a half more fields you're adding in here once you plow it, cut these trees down. I mean, like you know, like I said, we are going through that parking lot if you don't need the space. You, you are almost turning this 0 0.74, 0 0.78 hectare field into a 2.0 hectare field, which is considerable uh, without having to go too far. You got three fields right here. Um, I'm into grass and silage and sheep, stuff like that, so plowing a field and getting grass, which a plowed field with planting grass is more yield than just going around and plowing grass or uh, mowing grass wherever you want. So trying to make this whole thing one big field between 14, 15, and 12 was something I was looking to do, and I did add a considerable amount in doing that uh, to 15. So, hope you liked the video. Like, subscribe. I mean, it really gets me stoked, man. Like the video. Um, check out my other videos. I got some funny ones on there. I got some basic funny ones, but more to come. Um, like I said, this Hectaker mod uh, gave me an idea to see actually how much bigger I'm making this field. One other thing to note is that when we harvested the first time, we dumped it into their semi-trailer, our tipper, and you can see on the bottom right, soybeans, 7% full, um, 4,316 liters into this trailer. Um, the second time, we were at 0.78, and that's everything that's in the harvester right now. That's at 4,982. Uh, the percentages are off they both hold different amounts but the idea is 49.82 compared to 43.16 um, with just newly plowing the field cultivating seeding um, sometimes the hired workers don't like that I think if a field needs to be plowed they're just gonna go off of the last uh, boundary that you had cut if the previous hired worker had messed it up or if you didn't get everything so uh, it's that's why we're plow life, plow everything, plow it all. Plow it often, and it gets you a nice clean cut field here. Uh, GPS mod will help you add to this field and make it nice and clean and straight. I uh, recommend getting that mod at least, GPS mod. Uh, the Sect Acre mod is awesome too, especially if you like to keep track uh, of how much you're cutting a session or during a day or whatever, life of the harvester. So I recommend getting them both. Plow Life, thanks. Like, subscribe, share, whatever. Uh, we'll see you in the next one.